Good morning. This is a face of someone that has not slept all night. Thanks has been up since 3.30. I'm gonna make a coffee. We are in Australia. Just went to the store and I got all these yummy fruits and we're gonna make a fruit salad. And we got a naked buddy eating a smoothie. Yummy. You gotta put clothes on. Hey. Clothes on! <laughs> So Banks pretty much was up since 3.30, so he is a little delusional. He took a nap already, but he usually never takes super early naps. And today he has, so we're gonna we're gonna be this gonna be a long day. I've decided to make a papaya boat because Banks smashed my papaya. <laughs> he is on one today, let's just say. <gasps> oh. Some mango, passion fruit, and some coconut yogurt in the papaya. What do you think? You wanna try it? This is actually really good. My um, food never looks Instagrammable. <laughs> this is how we get ready for the beach. We constantly bring stuff to the car. <laughs> it takes us about an hour. What? And this guy is sitting in the front seat waiting for Mama and Dada to be ready. No, no, Baba. Oh, he's found something. It's finally sunny, so we're gonna go to the beach. Banks is gonna come, and we got a ton of sun protection because help here in Australia. Me, please help me, help me. Because here in Australia, the sun is like no other and it burns you pretty much at 7 a.m. Um, I think it's like 7.30 right now and it's like high in the sky. To the beach, Baba. Thanks. <gasps> We're going beach. Is it hot? It's hot, bro. We at the beach and we got this the sickest tent. A little Coachella set up right here. Yeah, we're just going to be partying on the beach. The sun skin. Let me get out of the way. Sun skin. Super easy to put up and it creates kind of way more shade than your regular umbrella. What do you think, awesome. babe? Yeah, it's zero plastic. Zero plastic and protects you against sun cancer. Brought Malia down, so she's gonna watch Banks while we surf and it's literally the most perfect day ever. Hey buddy! You found a, a tree to go on? How fun is this? There's your warm up for your surf, babe. He doesn't want me to touch it. Jack's gonna take him for a swim. Sometimes he just only wants dad when he's at the beach. So I have to accept it.
research is done. Takeaway. We got some lattes. I got the green bowl, and I went crazy. Jack went crazy. I doesn't want me to film this burger, but he's eating it right now, so I have to film it in the car. Ooh. Vegan burger. Ooh. Just got back from the beach, and we decided to grab some takeaway lunch because it's really hard to sit at a restaurant with Banks nowadays. I got. Um, it's called the Byron green bowl we went to a place called niche co it's here on the gold coast right in tugan and yeah it's super yummy it's just greens and it's in a bowl with some coconut yogurt some strawberries some cashews and i think banks is gonna have some of mine also got there is, there some is coconut latte yes yes we are having a second cup of coffee already we need it Two back-to-back. -back. We deserve this. Two back-to-back -back nights of three hours sleep. Ooh, Strawberry or yogurt? Or or would you like to try some cashews? This one. You want strawberry? Strawberry. When you have a kid, you just are pretty much used to them sticking their hands in your food. Green bowls are a must because it's just too hot here to eat anything else. What's in the green bowls, babe? Oh, so Banks just went down for another nap because we just slept so bad last night and I feel like he barely got any sleep either. Um, but yeah, I think we are gonna actually go tandem surfing because we need to go have some fun, even though surfing for us is fun, but it's a little bit of, um, I guess you could say work for us, but um, yeah, I just need to go have some fun because to be honest, I definitely have had a weird last few weeks. I pretty much, I don't know, I just can't find my rhythm here in Australia right now, which I usually do. Um, and I think there's just like a few things going on for me that, you know, that you have to like take into consideration just, you know, traveling with a child. And also I'm sure some of you guys noticed, but I'm no longer sponsored by Rip Curl. Um, and yeah, it was just kind of like a big change for me from going from being sponsored my whole life pretty much since I was like 14 to now not having a main sponsor. Um, as surfer, as like a professional surfer, that's like a huge thing. And, um, you know, as excited as I am for change and what's to come, it's definitely a little bit scary and I think that it's affecting me a little bit more than what I thought. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited and, you know, things ended okay with them. They um, pretty much, for people that are like, have been following me super closely, probably noticed that they stopped using me pretty much after I had banks or found out that I was pregnant. Um, they really didn't like that I had a kid. So um, yeah, I kind of just decided to, or we'd, we've kind of both decided that we needed to go our separate ways. Um, they, yeah, no longer really wanted to use me anymore. And I just kind of want to be with a company that really supports me, like who I am today and what I'm going through. Um, and yeah, that just wasn't rip crawl at the time. So as much as we have gone through and stuff, and I think I rode for them for about 15, 14 years, um, it was just time for change. And I definitely am super excited, but it is really scary. And um, yeah, I just kind of have been going through a bunch of stuff like kind of mentally where I question what I'm doing, like, am I doing everything right? Am, like, you know, I kind of have been doing a lot of negative self-talk, which I definitely used to do in my early 20s, and that always led to really bad eating, binge eating, just kind of bad stuff. So 
Um, I learned not to do that, but just recently I have been doing a lot of like negative self-talk, which is just not good. It's not good for anyone. So I'm realizing that and I just want to go have some fun with Jack while Banks is sleeping and come up from the slump that I am and you know it's all mental it's all what I'm feeding myself so I know sometimes it can be hard to tell yourself good things or be positive because you know in the world we are in today we see so much stuff on social media and you know everyone's having a good day but really like not everyone is having those perfect days every day um, just like me I have had in, I've been having some really weird days for the last few weeks and I haven't shown that so you guys might not know that but I am and um, yeah I just kind of wanted to come on here and let you guys know that because otherwise um, you guys are gonna think you know I'm having just the best days ever and I never have bad days and um, that's just not true it's just um, social media can just kind of do that to you and I just want to be more transparent and let you guys know that I'm not having an easy time and that's kind of all from me doing because it's my self-talk and that's I think the first thing that um, you have to realize is where is it coming from and how can you make yourself feel better if it's just like giving yourself like more positive feedback or just getting out and moving your body eating healthier for me it's just like you know checking off all those and that's when I know I'm gonna um, be happy and be my best self for Jack and Banks but yeah, I'm gonna go have some fun and love you guys. I hope you like the vlog. It's a little all over the place, but hopefully I'm gonna start filming more. I'm just so bad at this, but yeah, I just wanna let you guys know I go through things all the time and that's probably why, the number one reason why I don't film is because I'm not having the best time and why would I wanna film that? <laughs> why would you guys wanna see that? No, I'm kidding. But um, okay, love you guys. So good now